Hey and welcome to a new week. We are back on Lime Rock. This time it's a GP layout with the chicane, which is a big challenge. It's extremely tight for GTE cars and you really have to be careful around the red curbs. If you hit them and get unlucky, your car may end up looking like this. Over the course of a full race, this damage can add up and make the race even more difficult for you. But now let's take a look at the lap. We are approaching the braking zone into turn 1, which offers the only real opportunity to attempt an overtake. If you manage it to use the slipstream, you can try to attack on the inside. This applies for your opponents as well, so make sure to check your mirrors. Use the free 2 and 100 meter boards as orientation for braking, tap the brakes and transition into tray braking after a first hard touch. Turn 1 is all about hitting a smooth and tight line and managing your momentum. You want to decelerate deep into the corner and hit the throttle only once, to accelerate onto the short straight. Avoid going back and forth between brakes and throttle, cause this will cost you time. Focus on one braking phase and one acceleration phase. Hit a tight run around the exit and keep pushing the car to the right side of the track. That way you get a wider entry into the next left hander. There's no brake marker, tap the brakes and trail brake into the turn. You want to aim for a tight exit like last time. Exit along the curb and keep pushing the car to the left. The further you are on the left, the more speed you will be able to carry through the next turn and onto the short straight. Lift while turning in to adjust your apex speed. You want to work with your throttle here and avoid touching the brakes. You want to break quite early here, way before you reach the tree. You can use the small kink in the white line as marker. Hit the brakes hard and drive onto the curb to get a slightly wider entry, which allows you to carry more speed into the chicane. You saw what can happen if you attack the red curb, so be nice to your car and avoid them. Lift before turning in, tap the brakes slightly if you feel like you are going too fast and try to carry as much speed as possible into the last turn. Use the curb on the exit, you can even clip the grass here without receiving an incident point. And again, lift slightly before you turn in to make the last turn and carry as much momentum as possible towards the line. That's the guide lab. The cockpit lab with telemetry will come up next. If you are looking for more tips or need help, don't hesitate and join our Discord community where you can find a ton of useful links and friendly people. I wish you all the best for your races and see you next time.